Hey everybody, it's Professor Williams and I'm going to show you in a quick video how to create a scatter plot using Excel. All right, so I have data collected from 200 customers. Um, I have their pur purchase amount in hundreds, their satisfaction with the transaction on a scale from 1 to 5, whether or not they were a repeat customer, a gender, and then income, which is actually in thousands. And what I want to do is I want to plot purchase against income. In other words, I want to use um, income as a predictor of their purchase amount. That makes income the variable on my horizontal axis and purchase on my y-axis. The easiest way to do that is to put these in two columns side by side. So I said I was going to let income, I'm control C, predict their purchase, control C, control V, and now I have the two variables side to side. I'm going to come up to insert and I'm going to select scatter plot. And because I already had my data side by side, I didn't have to mess with flipping my horizontal and vertical axis. So now I can make the chart look like I want. Right, so I'm going to want, I always make my um, font on my axes bigger because nobody can see read anything from that. I'm just using font I just happen to know which one I want, so I say OK. <clears throat> and now I can use the plus to add other things, and I want axis titles. And so this axis title is going to be on the horizontal axis is income, and then on my vertical axis I had, just delete that, I had purchase amount. Never send a chart out into the wilderness without without it being properly labeled. Um, and I, then I can make all kinds of changes. If I want to make it fancy looking, I can change the color scheme. But what you end up with is you end up with a perfectly sound, accurate scatter plot. And the secret to that is put your X on the left and your Y on the right and then just select insert scatter plot and you don't have to do all of that transposition that seems to make these things so troubling. So I told you it wasn't going to take that long. We're all finished. Hope that you find this helpful and thanks for watching.